Well, well, well. What have we here, my pretties? Welcome to the Tiger Pit. That's right. It is Friday. Beer 30. Looks like we have a little fellers of the orange here. Fellas of the orange. Brought to you by Brian's Knives. Now, this really isn't a fillers of the orange, but I am showing orange knives. Uh, this concludes my week-long showcase of case series, and I've kind of hit a brick wall. Like, I have three of these and two of those and three of these. So I figured I would just highlight uh, case persimmon orange and a few other oranges by case. This is Bodhisattva, Indian Pale Ale, in an orange can. Kind of matches my cayenne bone a bit. Let's put that out there. Yes, this concludes. The fun is over. Let's start it off with my only smooth persimmon orange. This is the tiger. The tired tiger, chilling out in the Sahara Desert, the plains, looking for its next prey. Double X shield, double X on the front bolsters. This is true sharp stainless steel. Full size trapper. You have all seen this. If you haven't, here it is. Awesome tiger stripe jigging on the pile side with black in it. I think this may be a Smoky Mountains exclusive. Don't quote me on that. I'm not 100% sure. Um, I have seen them listed there. Uh, they're no longer available. And I have seen a mini trapper. It said coming soon. So I put my notification in. I don't know if that's an old post or what. This was released in November of last year, 2023. Great find by Gunslinger Cow. Found it on eBay. Sent me the link. I picked it up. Pretty expensive trapper. But all in all considered, probably got it for about retail. Very nice to have my collection. I'm a huge orange fan. I love persimmon orange. I love smooth bone. And this even has a tiger to boot with the double X's. Very cool. My first orange would be the persimmon orange. This is the peach sheed jig. And it's definitely, definitely bright. Absolutely love this orange. You've all seen it if you watched my case collection. Nice lights in there. Just beautiful knife. True sharp stainless steel. Pretty plain. No threaded bolsters. No crazy bells and whistles. Just beautiful peach seed jig orange with the standard case shield. I guess I could leave them blade out. That's always fun. Had to pick up the Sodbuster Jr. Persimmon orange. Now, the cayenne bone and the persimmon look really close. I keep seeing pictures of the cayenne bone Sodbuster and the persimmon, and I honestly couldn't tell the difference. They didn't have, you know, the, the cayenne has X's and double threading on the bolsters, but the Sodbuster doesn't have any bolsters so you can't do that, but you can see the difference. Cayenne bone, and all the bone varies, so maybe I got an orangier cayenne bone, maybe some are lighter. I've seen some full-size trappers that have almost white right here near the bolsters. Um, I know Terry's Nice and Man Stuff has a full-size, I might as well show this one now, full-size trapper, this is the mini trapper. I uh, had to pick this up. It was really gritty. That blade wouldn't even close when I got it from the factory and had to lube it up pretty good. Beautiful orange. A little bit more like, a little bit more reddish in there. This is a Krendel jig, which does make it different. So I'm sure that is the difference, you know, between the persimmon peach seed 
would have Crandall Jig also if it was a cayenne bone. Beautiful oranges. Absolutely love them. These are all true sharp. And of course, so I had the large trapper and the Sodbuster Jr. I had to get the mini trapper, but uh, I didn't really pull the trigger on it. I always wanted one of these cayenne bones. And the cayenne bones were kind of pricey, so I figured if I'm getting one, I'll get the mini trapper. So I got that instead of a persimmon orange mini trapper. I figure I bust this pin out from RDS Woodwork. It's kind of orange. It's wood colored. I'd say that's orange. It's like orange wood. Very cool pin. Got my logo there, acrylic in. So I wanted to show a few more oranges. I was really excited about the Harvest Orange when they first uh, came out because I've always wanted a Harvest Orange. Uh, this is peach seed jig. This isn't a uh, corn cob like the old Harvest Orange. Um, uh, really happy I got this. This is a really good deal. And, and you can see the orange in there, but there is more brown in this, obviously, being a harvest, kind of an autumn fall colors. True Sharp stainless steel. Now, these really vary a lot. Some are brown, brown. Some are really light orange. I can't remember who I just saw on Instagram who got, I think it might have been Sanctified, got maybe a mini trapper in the harvest orange. And his is actually orange. You know, you can see a little orange there. You can see some orange here. And this is my lightest Harvest Orange. Yeah, his kind of look like that, which is what Harvest Orange should look like. For some reason, I get stuck with a lot of dark ones. Like this is almost a brown bone with hints of orange. I think Sanctified. This might be even darker than Sanctified's. Beautiful. I'll keep this side out. So you can see we get from light to dark. I don't know how many oranges are out there. My trapper is, this is a harvest orange and you'd almost not believe it. Like, can you see some orange in here? Maybe, almost like a tan color. So yeah, I mean, what are you gonna do? I guess I could order another one. And um, if it's more my liking, I could, Put this on eBay and sell it. But I'll just keep it and use it. I have some brown bones. I have some mahogany bones. And this kind of really goes really well and with them all. So yeah, nothing too special. Just wanted to share some oranges here with you. To conclude my week-long extravaganza of the Case Knife series. Like I said, I have two of these or three of those, and I'm not going to continue on. This will conclude it. And uh, the uh, there's a few knife review I'm, I definitely want to do. Got a few more knives in. So we will be going to that format really soon. I got some stuff in the mail that's going to be here. Um, I want to just like unbox them and show them all at once, but I may just pull one out at a time and do a review of each individually. Thank you very much for joining me. You all stay sharp, be kind, and take chances. Take care.